Hello guys and welcome back to another mCreator tutorial. Today what I'm going to be covering is how to install plugins and basically find the plugins folder. So let's go into mCreator.net. We're going to go ahead and find a plugin. So if you want to do that, you go to the community tab and then you will be presented with the options for the different types of content. There will be trending mods down here, a whole bunch of other things. You can see some trending plugins. You can click on those to get to the page or explore plugins. Or what you could do is you could just go and click on at the top of the thing right here, uh, M Creator Plugins. And that will bring you to a list of different plugins. So depending on what, what one you actually want, uh, you can basically click on the uh, particular one uh, if it's like a fabric generator or something like that then what you can do is you can go over it and then there will be some options down here for downloading it will say plugin downloads so that's basically as simple as it is you just grab the zip file so it's going to be a zip uh, in our case I will be grabbing one of these in some cases uh, when you open up M creator maybe a plugin has updated so what it's going to do is it's going to prompt you to install a new plugin so if you want to do that you just click on update plugin and it'll bring you directly to the plugin page and then you would perform that same step over again so you just download it and it will download to your computer wherever you have your downloads uh, directed to that's where it will be and then what you can do is you can basically go to that folder we'll go into my downloads because that's where it is and then we'll take that out of there and then what we can do is we can actually start to install the plugin so we can just close this window for now and then what we're going to do is we're going to go to preferences uh, while amp creator is still open and then what we're going to do is we're going to go down to manage plugins and then you can see that I have a few of the file manager, fabric, essentials, and um, I think there is fabric installed too. I'm not seeing it, but it, it should be in there. All right, so what you want to do is you want to open plugin folder. Now this will direct you to uh, your actual account. So C users, then your account, dot am creator, plugins so that's where your plugins will be actually installed this is the general folder for all your plugins now what you in order to update you can't actually have M creator open so you have to close out of all this or any other ones that you have open and then what you can do is you can basically place this in here and then remove the older version that you no longer need so in our case we don't need the fabric essentials we're just going to delete that one so once you've done that all you need to do is close out of that folder and then boot it back up and it's simple as that so you'll see that we don't didn't get the message again that's because we have the most recent update so everything is working as expected uh, now if you want to actually test if the update is working for that particular plugin you can just go back to your managed plugins and it should say loaded and in our case, uh, Fabric Essentials is loaded. It has a little green yes on it. So that means that it's all good to go and ready to use. So hopefully you found today's tutorial useful. If you're new to my channel, don't forget to subscribe, comment down below, rate the video, and I will see you guys next time. Thanks for watching. Peace out.